at Numerian Capital, we bring you the latest stock news each day. Please like and subscribe so we can bring these articles to you each day. Thank you. Today, September 16, 2022, No Lab stock falls on IPO. No Lab stock went public at $2 a share and was able to upsize its offer. No Lab stock was trading over the counter as of yesterday, but as of today, it's now carried out an IPO. The company was able to upsize its offer, going from an offer of 3 million shares at $2 a piece, up to 3.6 million shares at $2. No Labs developed a way to monitor glucose levels in a non-invasive way and hopes to gain traction going forward. Shares of No Labs, NYSE, KNW, are trading messily on Friday. The stock is down about 18% so far on the day, as investors size up the current environment. Unfortunately, it's a risk-off type of day and that's not boding well for no lab stock. As it pertains to the broader market, today is a triple witching, or if you prefer, quadruple witching, expiration day. It only happens four times a year and tends to lead to choppy price action for the day. That's as funds and investors rebalance their positions and unwind derivative trades. While that may not directly impact no lab stock, the impact it's having on the market is not positive and therefore, not lending a helping hand to no labs. That aside, the company has gone public by offering 3.6 million shares at $2 a piece. That was upsized from an original 3 million share offer at $2 a piece. There's a 45-day option to purchase up to 540,000 additional shares at the same price. That could turn out to be quite the opportunity if the stock can find some upside momentum. What is no lab stock and is it a buy? The situation with no lab stock is not exactly black and white. The stock is actually up about 7% from the initial public offering price. However, it's down about 15% from where it closed last night. Previously, no labs was traded over the counter and closed at $2.53 on Thursday. For investors that are out of the loop, that's likely to cause some confusion today. As for what it does, the company developed a way to monitor glucose levels in a non-invasive way by using radio waves through the skin using what No Labs calls BioRFID technology. The 15-person company is looking at the capital raise as a way to infuse some capital into its business. Founder and Chairman Ron Erickson said that a cash infusion will help the company boost its overall profile while getting exposure to additional funding and institutional investors. Prior to the recent listing, no Lab said it had enough funding to last through next June. The hope is that the upsized listing will be more than enough to carry the company until its business can fully support its operation. Thanks for watching. Numerian Capital News. Please come back tomorrow for another stock news update. Thank you.